hello everyone and welcome to a new video so today we are unboxing the ender 3 3d printer and it was a christmas gift and i was really excited to open it up and start assembling it So the first thing we have here uh, is a bag with the assembly instructions. The instructions are, for the most part, uh, well done. Um, I was able to get through a lot of the assembly with the instructions. And there's maybe like one or two steps that are a little bit confusing because the pictures aren't clear, but you know, you'll be able to tell what part goes where once you get through most of the way um, but other than that uh, assembly was pretty straightforward and didn't have any issues First comes out the LCD screen. It comes um, in a bag. No cover on the back, so you gotta print one. Next we have the, the bed and all the lower assembly. Here we have the x-axis and is the power supply um, just got to make sure that you switch it to 115 because it comes set for 220 I believe 220 volts so you have to make sure you get it to 115 if you're in the US it comes with a bit of tools um, spatula um, some allen wrenches, clippers, wrenches. Here we have the Z axis rod and the two, the two vertical aluminum channels for for the Z axis. Get a power cable filament holder and you get a bag of filament and there's a bunch of other bags with uh, bolts and tools and everything comes labeled real well it, it tells you on the instructions what to use on which part so there's really no way for anyone to put the wrong parts where they don't belong. They are labeled real well and I was glad that they did that.
this point where I realized that I put that beam the wrong way, so I had to take it off and turn it around because the power supply would not bolt on correctly, so I had to turn it around. song is called I Love Destruction. Look it up.
Well guys, this is it for this video. I have already made some prints. I will share them with you guys in the next video. I hope you guys liked it. Like, subscribe, leave a comment. And I'll see you guys next time.